We begin with breaking news in Valley Glen, where multiple people have been shot. At least one person has died. Good evening. I'm Micah Ullman. And I'm Cher Calvin. Gil Levis is overhead in Sky 5. Gil. Chair Mike, you're looking at the intersection of Coldwater Canyon and Victory Boulevard now. LAPD responded here right around 10 o'clock this evening to a shots fired call. Let's go to some video that we shot when we arrived uh, right after the shooting happened. We were in the area, we flew right over here. I can tell you that uh, three people were shot at this corner. This is the southwest corner of that intersection. They transported one person that was conscious and breathing to a local hospital, and then another one af shortly after that. But I can tell you that, uh, unfortunately, there's one confirmed dead person here at the scene as a result of that shooting. Let me push in and show you where the shooting occurred, right next to the smoke shop. And if I come in tight, you can see the two vehicles that collided here during that shooting. You can see some bullet holes in that front windshield. Now the uh, investigation underway to this deadly shooting is happening here at this intersection. It's completely shut down at this point. Homicide detectives are on scene investigating. That's the latest overhead up in Sky 5. I'll send it back to you in the studio. All right, Gil, thank you. From the air to the ground and Carlos Sancedo live near the scene in Valley Glen. Carlos. Mike and Cher, good evening. Things still very fluid out here. Multiple people were shot at this intersection in Valley Glen. Take a look here. A witness telling me earlier that he heard about 13 to 16 gunshots go off here. But as you can see, things very active. Multiple police officers, they are on the ground gathering evidence, interviewing witnesses. Police got the call of shots being fired just after 10 o'clock tonight. LAPD saying three people were shot, one dying from their injuries in what appeared to be some type of car to car shooting, some type of altercation. Now you can see three bullet holes in the windshield of a Mercedes sedan. When police got to the scene, there were multiple people on the ground. A Mercedes sedan and Mercedes SUV were involved in some type of crash, both vehicles with front end damage. Again, I spoke with a witness earlier telling me that he heard the gunfire from his home. All of a sudden I heard like about like 10 or 5 shots, you know, just like and it was it was loud. I thought it was I actually thought it was like a car exhaust, you know, like you know how the car exhaust makes noises like that? Like old cars especially, you know, they like to make those noises. Yeah, so just a very chaotic scene. Again, people are starting to gather here at this intersection in Valley Glen. Police just starting their investigation here. Again, we know that three people were shot. At least three people were shot in this shooting. One person dying from their injuries. That's latest here in Valley Glen. Carlos Salcedo, KTLA 5 News.